Hi, I'm Father James. This is Off the Collar. Uh, we have a special episode, if you will, uh, for uh, today. We have uh, the uh, confessional that has been recently renovated. And uh, this is our new confessional doors. We have one over here for the penitent side, and we have another one over here where the confessor is. Uh, that's uh, the priest who hears confession. They call him confessor, and the person who is confessing their sins is called the penitent. Uh, I'll, uh, during confession, actually, I'll just draw a note to the sound makers. So these sound makers, we turn these on for confession so that they make a lot of noise. So that helps muffle the uh, sound of all of the uh, sins that are being confessed <laughs> so that no one uh, hears what's going on. But uh, we have a really good sound insulation on these walls. And also these doors are very thick, uh, just as an extra precaution, just to make sure that nobody hears the sins of anybody else. We run the sound makers or the noise makers, the white noise makers, uh, white noise makers um, for uh, confession uh, when their uh, uh, confessions are being heard. So here, this is the penitent side. So as we come into the penitent side, uh, we see that there's a, uh, a cyst bar uh, for uh, our elderly brothers and sisters. There's also the kneeler, of course and the person can kneel here. And if they want to have their face-to-face uh, -face confession, they can simply raise the screen like so. And then we can be able to see the priest through the other side and have a face-to-face -face confession. And of course, when the person is done, they just pull that blind right down. And we also have a little mail slot here so that if the uh, priest wants to give you any notes or hand out any pamphlets or booklets, then it's very simple to, for, that, uh, for that to take place. Uh, we also have, of course, the uh, seat or bench and it's pretty cushy comfortable and uh, and if the kneeler gets in the way we can always flip the kneeler up because it folds up towards the wall like that so you can see that very easily and then we have enough foot room for a person to also have their confession heard uh, face to face while sitting if they don't want to kneel and so once again uh, this is uh, uh, then uh, the uh, way in which we have our confessions heard and this is the uh, penitent side and then the kneeler it goes down and then the blind goes down and then if the person needs some assistance they have the grab bar here so that they can uh, get out uh, very easily and of course I'll show you my side or the uh, confessor side we have here a similar door same kind of door with uh, Jesus Christ the uh, crucified Christ on the doors it is uh, of course a symbol that there's something very sacred going on in what I call the freedom box because people come here to gain greater freedom in Christ. And so this is our crucified Lord uh, that lets us know that this is a very uh, sacred event that goes on here. When we walk into uh, the, uh, pen, uh, the confessor side, rather, uh, I usually will sit down in my chair and then um, I will uh, spin around uh, to, to hear confessions. And then I have over here my light switches so I can turn on my green red light and I turn it green or red if there's someone in the confessional. So I have a green light uh, says go so, so the confessional is available. And then I have a red light that says someone is in here or it's occupied. And then when I'm done, I just turn that light off. And of course I have all of my uh, confessor or confessor supplies here. Uh, I call this my crash cart. All right, so that I have all my uh, supplies. I have Benedictine medals. I have post-its with pens here to uh, write things down for people. Uh, all kinds of different uh, um, booklets to, to give out uh, if I need to give them out. So I was talking about the lights, and I'll show you the lights out there if you look on the ceiling uh, over here above the penitent room. You can see that there's a uh, green light here. Uh, when it's okay to go in and then of course if you flip the switch we'll go flip the switch back to red and you can see that uh, when it's when someone is in there then the light is red all right and then when it's not in use we turn them off so that's the green light red light and that will help people also know whether or not someone is uh, in the confessional as we don't want people walking in uh, during confession and so this is uh, the basic uh, our, our basic confessional it's a very nice confessional and um, uh, we're very proud of it.